Good evening and welcome to episode 81 of Season 8 of Factory Town, where last episode we left off with a sugar shortage because no sugar was getting down to our uh, antidotes. And that was because I didn't have a sugar train. I, I could have sworn I did have a sugar train, but I went through every last one of the trains and couldn't find one. So I don't know what happened to it. But now we do have a sugar train and it's stuck because, well, um, sugar. We don't have sugar in this station anymore. This is a cotton station, so let's send the sugar train off to the actual sugar stop, which is this one here. So we can now do the thing and we can get our cotton going again. So, with the sugar done and the antidotes being made, let's go up here and have a look. Let's see, here we have antidotes. Antidotes in there, we have health potions there, everything's awesome. We're gonna make elixirs here. But we want to make wards first. We're gonna make Wards. so let's do that now um it was mentioned in the previous episode i've done it again i had i had my comments up because i'm like oh yes i must remember that and then i closed the page before i start recording i've got to stop doing that because it's not good for it so um uh where is it where is it with strix ocean ocean ocena ocena it's not ocean it's ocena um, could make the uh, uh, the mana pipe system underneath here the uh, this uh, terrible bleh, uh, make it better um, if I put the recharges behind the barn. I put the recharges down here. Probably could. Probably could. It would not only would it, it look better. It might be easier to follow because this is. Uh, overly complicated for what it is so i i would like to give that a go i would like to give it a go let's remove all this here um, like so just remove debris okay and if we move these to be here now i've got to put them right up close to the barn um because we need access to behind them. Although I could run the pipes out onto the edge here. It doesn't matter. Um, I haven't really done that just because I don't I didn't want to, but there's no reason why I couldn't run the pipes out onto the edge here. Um and yeah, that that would work. That would work. Um and then what we do is we connect all the pipes together. So they all output into the same place. And then we go here, here, bump, and bump. And then what we can do is we can just literally come out of these. And into the back of them. That would work. So if we take them out of here. I mean, if I wanted to stay inside the... Uh, loop we could we could we could do that we could do that if i if i move these forward and we want to stay inside the area the, the only issue to this is that some barns we require more output so we use the edges of them so this might not work uh, the other option i've got is a recharger for each building which is an option i could put it right next to the building and then run its own little individual loop um, and that is an option so i don't know i don't know We'd, ha we'd have to go out here anyway because I need to come in that and then you would have to go down to there you go to there and then this would have to be set as an output so I'll copy that and paste it there and there so it's an output only and outputs depleted mana crystals and this is an input for purified crystals only so we then put a spitter here and here and here and So now the crystals get charged up here, uh, all end up on the same line, get split evenly left and right and get split left and right between the four, four buildings. And then they come out and come out of here, they come out onto the same line, go into the back and carry on. That uses less mana pipes as well, which is always good. 
um, but also is a lot easier I feel to look at so if anyone was confused by the way I did things um, that's 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 probably simpler to look at and see it flows very nicely you can see the way the arrows flow, flow through and um, the only, cha only change I've done is the mana connector that's on the building in the corner change it to an output only basically just copied copy this one control c one mass over it and control control v so it's the same thing so it will only output depleted crystals and won't try and input anything into the system it can't input depleted crystals anyway but it's probably just better to be safe than sorry and then this by this splitter will just split between three evenly so so that that works that works thank you for that suggestion that that works pretty well um, I was kind of toying with the idea of having like just putting in four for each one and having its own, or each one on its own individual loop. But uh, this way probably works better because now I can still drop in, um, like drop a box in and drop 20 in or however we want to drop in 50, wasn't it? With 50? No, 40. Two boxes. Two boxes. Two boxes. Okay, so let's come up here and let's make some wards. I haven't changed, that's the wrong place. I haven't changed anything here with um the mana crystals um, i was going to but i haven't um probably should but um i haven't yet so we're not gonna bother with that we're gonna we're gonna leave this here because i might i might change it down here to have just more mana crystal production i, I really feel as if i want more mana crystal production we don't use it that much in places it's not like constantly used but I feel like it, it is it's not consumed in many places um that's what i mean it's, it's recharged you you recharge a lot of the crystals so you only need to like take 20 or 40 out of the system and put them in other places but that's a lot um when you're building lots of things so we, we, we'll be building like the enchant the, uh, the war system now and then there'll be even more magic stuff later on uh, and they all require all, almost all of them require mana power. See, all these here require mana power. Um, I think there was one more that consumed mana. It might be the Omni Temple itself, which is Endgame, but yeah. Um, so, so what do we want to do here? What do we want? We want to make wards, um, and I need to figure out right. Wards are consumption time of sixty. 90 seconds we are going to sell the wards i don't think they're using anything uh, a bit look down here nope they're not using anything they're just they're just a sellable good so we will just sell uh, unlike health potions which are used in elixirs so uh we'll just sell these and they can get us some purple coins coming in yay so um they are a consumption time of 60 and a happiness of 90 which means two and a half minutes each house consumes one in two and a half minutes. We're going to get to 90 houses because I should get to 90 houses. So we need to produce 90 of them in two and a half minutes. We produce 60 a minute. No, we produce six a minute with just one ward there. That's, that's not enough. That's not enough. That's six a minute, which is uh, times four because we have four buildings. Uh, well, hang on. So uh, we need 90 every two and a half minutes. So we're producing six a minute. So in two and a half minutes, we're producing 12, 15. Times four is 60. So we're 30 short. So we're going to have to add some boosters in here just to make the wards keep up. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Right. I don't have an enchanting template anywhere. I don't know where to put this. We'll probably run it off here. Uh, what do we need to bring in? We need to bring in uh, reinforced plank and polished stone. Are we making polished stone anywhere? I don't remember. Um, the easiest way to find out is to add it to the list. And it says zero. So no, we're probably not making it anywhere. Okay. Okay. I know for a fact we're making reinforced plates. So, so 
let's just put it on the first we'll put we'll put it right here we'll have a train station drop off on the line here so so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna copy this uh, well actually i'm gonna move the enchanter that's that right uh, uh, move the enchanter there and we're gonna copy this and rotate it around paste it there and get rid of these in fact we can get rid of a lot of stuff and redo a lot of things here but that's okay um oh there was one other thing i changed as well i can't remember where i changed it yeah damn it um oh it was books it was the books let me show you the book distracted but i need to show this or i forget um i multi-layered the outputs for the books um we weren't really producing enough books and it wasn't that we weren't producing enough we, we were producing enough but because i had it all on a single conveyor on the on the ground floor um they weren't getting out of the laboratories quick enough so now they are now they're they're multi-layered uh, i don't know if this one needs it or not but uh, but now they're multi-layered so uh, they're getting out and the actual train station ends up getting full before the train comes and picks up rather than the train having to sit here and wait so it's good it's good okay well back here uh, so We're gonna have to add some form of boost in here because we're not getting any worker bonus it, because this is not um although mana is gonna become one of our town centers isn't it um how far with civics for we require tech level eight so uh, this will be the next one yeah i think magic will be the next one uh because magic is used in many places and having a double thing is quite useful and the stuff to make here is expensive uh so so yeah Right, and then we just go. You do, you want to have you do wards because I only have a ward here, which means you want to become wards, and then your inputs are going to be reinforced plank and polished stone. Reinforced plank. Don't give me thoughts. No. Okay, don't. Oh. So, we're down here. We'll change this to reinforced plank or polished stone, whichever one doesn't matter. Get this side, and we'll make this one the other one. Reinforced plank. There we go. Now, what do you need of each? You need one of each. So that's okay. That's not a, not a terrible thing. Uh, and then we'll copy this, and paste these here. And I think that's good. I think that is good. I think that is so let us grab a station of the train let's grab all of this here just uh paste over that. that can go now i don't remember what was in that barn but it was obviously feeding something oh i had to reorder things in here so uh, right cut that off cut that off delete pause no. i don't know why i deleted the outside rail didn't need to do that but i did Copy. I'll go here. Rail through. Yeah. Don't know why I did it that outside rail. Clearly brain night gate. Uh, didn't copy the station. <laughs> I was like, hang on a minute, something's not right here. Where, where's the station? Shouldn't the station be inside the track? Wasn't that what we did? But then, like, no, no, it's not. That's what we do on the outside, not the inside. Uh, ah, ah, brain. The brain has failed me. Uh, so I'm going to turn these off for the minute and then start the game again because that can go along. And we'll get rid of that station there for the minute. And put it there. there. You know, I keep pushing T, which is status rather than R. Uh, oh, actually tells you your happiness. There, cool. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, and the maximum happiness. Nice. Nice. So I know what the uh, the maximum number is. Okay. So right now we want this to be reinforced banks and polished stone like that. And we'll turn the rest off. So you want to be polished stone. 
Rein reinforced pens. Don't. One, two. Right, I think we've got reinforced pens coming in somewhere. Uh, this wants to become wards. Be enabled. And this will store wards. Then we'll turn the rest off. There we go. Okie dokie. Right. And then I'm going to use uh, double double line, I think. Yeah. Well, not a double line, we're going to use a. Uh, uh, yeah, we're going to we're going to do this thing. No crates, don't need any crates here. That's fine. I can feed that one and then we'll figure out the one. So, so you want to be uh pushed down at the bottom and you want to be reinforced plank at the top. Okay, awesome. And then and then one, two plug. There we go. That should do all the things it needs to do there. And that should be good to go. That should be good to go. We do need to do some form of booster in here. Um, we're not really making many blue coins at the moment. But then wards sell for blue coins. No, they sell for purple coin. Mm. Uh, I mean, blue coins. 342, 60 in a second is not bad, I suppose. We could boost this. Coins. Although it will get the worker bonus. So... That will help us out. We'll, we'll leave it for the minute. We'll leave it for the minute. Uh, so, reinforced planks should be on the line somewhere already. I just think they're being used elsewhere, so we might not get a train up there enough for that. Polished stone, on the other hand, is uh, um, made in a stone mission in the artistry area, which is here. So, stone uh, yeah, polished stone is only made here in its only artistry. So we need to import just stone to here. Uh, now, I'm going to do it up over here because I don't... How many do we need? How many do we need? We need one every 10-ish seconds and you produce one every 10 seconds. Okay, might need to add some boosters to it because that's going to get happiness bonus. This is not. But that's okay. That's okay. I think what we'll do, we'll put this like right up here out the way. And just do the two for them and put it in a station here. Dropping off and picking up. That should be fine. Should be fine. So, move this to right here. Copy that. Paste that in there. I hope that's the correct. Yes, it is. Awesome. Right. Okay. Uh, and then you just want to be stone for the minute. I think that's the only thing you're going to be. And you want to be polished stone. station and put a new one in and uh, get rid of this station and then put a new one in here so I don't have to go around fighting all the uh, all the inputs for it oh, get rid of that. Uh, uh, oh oh uh, this wants to be uh, put down. didn't change that here that would have broken us that would have broken us right up uh, this wants to be warts no 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 this is the wrong but the wrong station. Oh, what are you doing? Um, this wants to be the uh, same as this. In fact, it's missing one. It's missing mana pipes. 
add mana pipe to this. Don't want wards. Don't. Incorrect. Just assume those are the right station. Wrong one. This one. This one is the one that needs to be warded. There we go. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. And then we're going to grab a belt from here. Here somewhere. And here we go. Here we go. Okie dokie. So let's, let's just copy paste something again. Um, it doesn't matter because we'll have to be doing all sorts of stuff. Um, no, can't do that. Need to move that out of the way. You'll do copy paste. Copy paste. The great thing about this modular system, copy paste it nice and easy. You do have to replace some stuff, but that's fine. You, know, you can just uh, quick tab over things, remove stuff, change stuff, do things uh, like this here. We do not need that much stuff there. Um, uh, so this is going to be uh, stone. And this one is going to be no, 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 no. This one's going to be polished stone. Good. So we're creating is at the top. And this is going to be stone. And then these two are going to be nothing. And I'm not being very conformative when I choose my nothing things. Some are nothing. Some are just disabled. Who knows? Who knows? Um, but we can do this because we know full well it's going to be uh, stone. With the amount of these I built, I'd know them by now. But I guess I don't. I guess I don't. Uh, polished stone is also not rollable, which is weird. Because you'd have thought it'd be just as rollable as the other one, but then I suppose you don't want to scratch it, so. Fair enough. Fair enough. Um put that there. Copy. Paste. Pished. This is not very fast building, so. gonna use shoots um, because I need this short doesn't really matter we're not um, it's not gonna really bother us for speed wise it's gonna be roughly the same speed that uh, did I set up the I didn't even set up the grabbers off here so that's not gonna work is it no it has got some reinforced planks there though that's good that's good um yeah but this should work because we're now gonna grab Actual, we're gonna grab the stone but it requires 10 stone which is a lot of stone it, it's a lot of stone that's that's yeah that's like almost a whole go in one hit so i might turn this up so we can stash more stone in it hold on to more and then we might have extra inputs around because it might not be able to feed in as many we'd like it to We'll see. We'll see. Okay. You are going to be set to stone. You are going to be set to stone. And all the others. Bum, 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 bum. And off polished stone. You are going to be set to polished stone. Again, we're going to turn the others off. I don't want a whole station full of uh, polished stone because I don't know what else I'm going to add to this. That uh, would help if I uh, left click instead of right click. Bump, there we go. can come along and plug it to there. And that's all good. Right, let's actually go and fix this. Actually get this doing the thing it's supposed to be doing. Because... Um, <laughs> uh, so this wants to be uh, polished stone, and then uh, come up by one, do a 
another one. We don't need to do it so tiny. <laughs> that. There we go. Let me just copy this. Paste. Paste. There we go. Okay, so they're going to start getting their reinforced banks. That's good. Now, let's go underground. Unfortunately, you cannot copy um, underground. Uh, there's no... There's no way to copy this this mana purposes. I'd love to be able to come down to here and just copy this and paste it in with all its settings and everything. But it, there's no way to do it that I know of. Uh, I can't see down here anymore. There used to be an option down here in the bottom left corner um, that allowed you to grab things. Um, I mean, it's still an option. Uh, we got the, uh, the select blocks. Does that work? Yes, it does. So that blocks works underground. Awesome. So if I paste that there, that's all right, and that's all connected automatically. And knows it's depleted mana crystals. And then we just go above ground. We get the recharges, and then we go one, two, and three, and that should work. Okay, let's test it. Let's test it. Let's grab the box. because 40 is a good number for all of them. Yep. Okay, good, you're good. Right, take this, place it back down again uh, there, and it should also empty because it's on the same grid. Good job. Up there. Over right here. And then we go back underground, and we will remove that. Now they all should have 10 in them, and that's that's perfect. That's exactly right. If we come down here, you will notice um, this one's have nine in. Uh, that is because they have finished one process, uh, one one recipe, and uh, the tenth crystal is right here. Uh, but until this ticks over and finishes, it doesn't become a depleted one. So it, it consumes all the resources, stops the recipe. Once it finishes the recipe, it uh, removes all the resources. So the tenth amount of crystal is here, hiding in the recipe. So they have ten in each. That's good. And uh, that means this should have 10 in each one. 10, 10, 10, and 10. Awesome. Now we just need polished stone. Where is the polished stone? Right, polished stone is coming because we have... Oh, awesome. We have polished stones on the way. Sweet. Here's the stone coming in. Going out all the places. This is good. Uh, didn't put in any grabbers. This is not good. There we go. Now, awesome, this is starting to fill, which means these are all full, which is fantastic, fantastic. Uh, something I do want to look at is steam boosters. Um, I think I've said it before, I wouldn't mind setting up, like, here in the corner, a little steam system uh, in between all of the uh, other places, and then have, like, the steam system feed um, a town. Essentially, like, but in, in the corner, have it feed this town and then put one here to feed this town and the corner for the corner and kind of right in the center is going to be where Omni Temple goes. Uh, but we could put steam in, and then even in some of the places that don't have any town centers, they can be getting steam bonuses. And steam bonuses are pretty good. Um, the steam bonus is two workers and quite easy to build. The setup for it's quite easy to build. So we might look into that next next time. So, uh, yeah, now this is going to take a long time to fill up. A long, long time to fill up. These take ten seconds to make. So, um, in ten seconds, we're making one box, and we need two hundred boxes. That's two thousand seconds. Yeah, ten seconds for one box. Ten times that is two thousand seconds. How long is two thousand seconds? 2,000 divided by 60 is half an hour. Yeah, we'll look into Steam next episode. Uh, so, thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this one, and I hope to see you again next time. And until then, as always, 
have fun.